Florida, Senator Marco Rubio has called the 2016 election a pivotal one that Republicans cannot afford to lose. After a strong showing in Iowa, he headed straight to New Hampshire and immediately found himself under verbal attack by another candidate. Fresh off his surprisingly strong third place finish in Iowa, Florida Senator Marco Rubio greeted supporters at a rally in Exeter. During a one on one interview with me today, Rubio brushed off the notion his strong caucus showing made him the Republican establishment choice. I'm not the establishment candidate. I've had $40 million of establishment money spent attacking me, more than every other candidate combined. So I got to the U.S. Senate running against the establishment, and I've had to run for president against an establishment that thought I needed to wait my turn in line. Rubio found himself squarely in the crosshairs of New Jersey Governor Chris Christie, who today described Rubio as, quote, the boy in the bubble. Christie accusing Rubio of always offering canned and rehearsed answers to questions, a criticism Rubio shrugged off. I think Chris has had a bad couple days, and sometimes when people are having a tough time, they say things they either they don't mean or later regret. I'm not going to go in. That's not what this campaign is about. Circling back to the issues, Rubio said he's keenly aware of the challenges on the minds of New Hampshire voters. People are concerned about our national security. And we have this rapid growth of ISIS trying to get killers into the United States. We have to deal with that. We have an economy that's not creating good paying jobs. An issue you have in New Hampshire that we're facing in Florida is opiate addiction and, and, and the deaths that people are suffering from overdoses. These are issues that the federal government can play a role in. And he said he is the only candidate who can beat Hillary Clinton should she become the Democratic nominee. If they nominate me, I, I will beat Hillary Clinton and the Democrats know that. They don't want to run against me, but I can't wait to run against them. Rubio finished just one percentage point behind Donald Trump in the Iowa caucuses. And tomorrow he has ta town hall meetings scheduled for Bow, Laconia and Dover.